Good afternoon, my name is Peter Leskis with Test Products International here in Beaverton, Oregon, and I'm here this afternoon to show you our Model 709 Combustion Analyzer. Um, this is our most popular and best-selling um, combustion analyzer. Um, what's unique about this particular unit is we've built in a digital manometer or a pressure meter inside of the unit. These two outlets on the back are plus and minus uh, positive and negative pressure, and that allows you to work on some of the higher efficiency equipment out there and, test, and uh, check the gas pressures. So that's one of the neat features of the 709. Um, very, very simple and easy to use. You simply want to take the 709 out to a clean air environment outside of your test area. <coughs> and you want to turn the unit on, and it's going to go through a 30 second um, auto set initialization process. Now, this particular instrument um, is going to measure very, uh, a bunch of different variables. It's going to measure CO, it's going to measure oxygen, it's going to measure CO2, it's going to give you a CO and CO2 ratio. Um, it will calculate excess air for you, it will also show you gross and net efficiencies and it will give you temperature as well as pressure. Um, <clears throat> everything internally is going to be time and date stamped. There's a 24 hour internal clock in the unit. So everything is going to be time and date stamped. So if you take, <coughs> shoot, so as you do a test, um, you can save the test parameters in your unit. Up to 50 different tests can be stored inside the unit itself. And if you're interested in printing out the results, you can get one of our infrared printers, our model A740 infrared printer. You just line up the two infrared ports, hit print, and your results will print out on the printer as well. So, um, real simple and easy to use. So, you get the unit turned on. Um, inside of 20 seconds, I can manipulate the type of fuel I'm working with, whether it's natural gas or LPG. I can do that by moving the cursor keys up and down. Um, once I've got this set, and it's set currently on natural gas, um, once it, once it uh, has that gas inside of it when it, at um, startup, that's going to be the default for the next time a year turn on your unit. So if you're always working with natural gas, you can set it to natural gas during the initialization process once, and every time you go back on the job and turn it on, your, your, that's going to be the default setting for your unit. Um, these particular units are warranted for three years, two years on the sensors. Um, calibration is essential or necessary on these products annually, uh, whether it's mine or my competitors. This particular unit um, has what we call electromechanical sensors in it, so they degrade over time. As soon as we initialize them and set them in the units themselves to send them out, um, they will start to degrade and regardless of how often you use them. So if you, use it, if you only use your combustion analyzer once last season, um, that doesn't mean that it doesn't need to be calibrated whether you used it once or a hundred times. Um, you need to have it sent in and get checked. The calibration fee here at TPI is $40 um, to get the calibrations done. So um, that's a very, very, uh, very, very fair price. So this particular unit, we turn it on in the outside air environment. We want to drill a hole in the flue where we're going to take our test or the test port. And I'm going to hook up my channel one temperature probe because this flue gas probe also acts as, as a temperature probe, a K-type thermocouple probe. There's also another beaded thermocouple probe included so you can do your differential temperatures. Um, but in this instance, if we just hook up the temperature and put this flue gas probe into the flue, as soon as I see, and I, and, I, and I strike up my furnace, as soon as I see that the um, temperature in the flue gas has stabilized, then I know that we're at steady state. At that point in time, I can hook up the, the remainder of my hose to the back of the unit using the mini filter assembly. And I just attach the hose to the back of the unit once I'm at steady state, and insert the probe into the flue, and take my tests, and begin taking my tests. Um, What's nice about an electronic combustion analyzer is that you can have this all set up in your test area and you can actually manipulate gas pressures um, or manipulate gas mixtures and actually see real-time results um, on your unit. So that makes it nice. Um, so this particular model, uh, like I said, is a, is a suggested list price of $549.95. Um, if you need additional information on this unit, or you like, um, or you'd like to know where you could, where you could purchase one, you can feel free to give us a call here. Our telephone number is one eight hundred three six eight five seven one nine. Or if you just like some more additional information, you can always visit the website. That's www.testproductsintl.com. Thank you.